Yazan Garib paints intricate landscapes of old Palestine using his daily coffee. He hopes to educate people about Palestine's history using the marriage of a brush and coffee grounds. The science behind the enjoyment of Arabic coffee is quite simple. Place a coffee pot full of water on a stove, wait for it to boil, drop in a spoonful of finely ground coffee and stir. Yazan Garib does this ritual every day, but not just for a drink. He uses a paintbrush and the grounds to paint pictures. His first exhibition was called Flavor of Spirit. We used to drink a cup of coffee every morning. It's a Middle Eastern custom, so I tried to draw the old cities of Palestine in 1900 by using coffee to connect between the old history of Palestine and the traditional beverage. And as I remember to drink a cup of coffee every morning, I want people to remember the history of Palestine. His attention to detail makes you think Garib really thought his choice of material through, but the decision to use coffee was born out of necessity. There was a delay in the money transfer from my family when I was studying in the Art Institute in Syria. And also, my family was not sending me enough money. So there was a drawing exam that I had to finish, and I had no choice but to use coffee to paint my portraits. Shot of Jerusalem, olive tree landscapes, and here, a portrait of the late Palestinian leader Yasser Arafat in progress. He is able to capture the feel of old Palestine by transferring its ancient love of coffee onto paper. We like coffee, we drink coffee every day, and just as I enjoy drinking coffee, I'm trying to make people enjoy the taste of the coffee in my portraits. His instinct to make full use of his morning drink has paid off. Several of the works here were snapped up by art lovers, with the most expensive going for 1,500 U.S. dollars.